Again, for the month of August, consumers felt more pessimistic about making major purchases of durable goods. Consumer confidence for durable goods decreased from 39.8 to 37.4. And they also felt they also felt less optimistic about future expectations. So their household, future financial situation, and future general economic conditions, consumers felt less optimistic about that index. Sentiment among urban consumers decreased by 1.6% from 41.7 to 41.1. While sentiment among rural, rural consumers decreased more sharply by 5.4% from 48.3 to 45.7. For urban consumers, the CCI was consistent with the national index, um, meaning that the reason for the decline was also based on decreases in expectations and durab durable goods. So urban consumers felt less optimistic about their future conditions, and they also felt more pessimistic about making those, about spending on those major purchases. However, for consumers in rural areas, their CCI dropped across all three components, even regarding the present. So when it comes to present conditions compared to 12 months prior, in rural areas, those consumers also experienced increased pessimism for that index. If we look at the CCI by sex, note that the overall upward movement of the male consumer confidence index up until August when it recorded a decrease at 47.5. So for males, their consumer confidence index was on an upward trend until it dropped in August. The opposite applies for females. They maintain a steady downward trend when it comes to overall confidence. For the month of August, when compared to July, the decrease in male consumer confidence was attributed to the expectations index, which decreased from 61.2 to 55.3. For females, their CCI dropped from 41.4 to 40.1, and this was mainly due to females feeling more pessimistic about making major purchases and less optimistic about their future households and general economic conditions. However, for females, they did express improved sentiment regarding present conditions compared to the males. 